Open those eyes wide. Excellent job. This isn't your typical eye exam. This camera uses an infrared light source to look inside the eye of the patient in their natural state. No dilation, no drugs, no drops. And in seconds? And we can see a view of a clean and healthy retina. Thanks to generous donations from grateful ophthalmology patients, Leahy was able to purchase these cameras. Now, patients at risk of degenerative eye conditions will be able to get diagnosed and treated before major damage is done. The man with the plan is Dr. David Ramsey, a Leahy ophthalmologist who was appointed as the first Lee Family Chair in Innovation. This endowed chair gives physicians the chance to develop new treatments and incorporate new technology into how they help patients. I think that the Innovation Chair is an absolute wonderful opportunity for us to uh, develop unique programs that uh, can really leverage the strengths of Leahy Hospital Medical Center. People fear blindness in many cases even more than death itself. With the help of new technology, he'll work to save people's eyesight. To be able to predict those things to head off problems, that is where I hope that we can innovate. This camera uses an infrared light source, so it's something that is very uh, uh, very tolerable and then we bring the camera in and with an undilated eye in the native state the patient comes we come right up to the eyes and once the frame is centered we peer inside the eye. The pictures it takes can be transferred to a patient's electronic health record allowing an ophthalmologist to instantly examine the eye from anywhere. Those pictures show the signs of diabetic retinopathy and glaucoma before patients experience any vision loss. Making these cameras available in primary care offices also makes these screenings accessible to more patients. Dr. Ramsey has already installed these cameras in Leahy Health primary care offices in Wilmington, Beverly, Hamilton, Amesbury, and Arlington. This summer, the Leahy Health Hub in Linfield the pharmacy at Leahy Medical Center in Peabody and Leahy Health Primary Care in Billerica will get cameras with which physicians can screen patients during routine visits. As for the future, Ramsey hopes to get this technology into the emergency department at Leahy Hospital and Medical Center, as well as Leahy Urgent Care locations. But this technology doesn't just have implications for the Boston area. And we sent one of the cameras uh, from the Leahy Teleophthalmology Program, one of our spare cameras, to Samoa last summer to take pictures of individuals within the Good Health Study on Samoa. Those pictures taken in Samoa were instantly sent back to Dr. Ramsey's office via the internet. We looked at all the slides we took the photographs of all these patients in Samoa, and then we were looking in our office. We looked for diabetic changes, we looked for hypertensive changes, we looked for glaucoma suspects or people with glaucoma. We found about a 10% rate of diabetes, a 3% rate of moderate or more severe retinopathy, and about a 10% rate also of concern for glaucoma. These are individuals, fewer than 1% of whom had had an eye exam within the last year, all of them, or nearly all of them, had diabetes, so they're not meeting the standard of care that we hold ourselves to here in the United States. This is just a start. What we're going to do moving forward is develop plans for telemedicine across our system. I want to take other forms of technology, not just into primary care, but across healthcare, into our hospitals, into our emergency and urgent care centers, and to reach more than just our eyes, but other parts of the body as well.